Okay, continuing on today with our Laplace transform playlist, we have here the Laplace transform of e to the at times some function f of t. And before I get started, if you want to know more about the Laplace transform, you can go through this whole playlist. We start with an introduction and some other examples. So I'll provide a link in the description of the playlist and also there'll be a link at the end of this video. And this is going to be actually a really useful Laplace transform just because the exponential we have, the exponential function already in the Laplace transform. So anything with an e to the at seems to work pretty nice, but let's let's go to our definition and just work this out and see what happens. So we're always gonna have e to the minus st times our function, which is gonna be this whole thing. So we'll write this as times e to the at and our f of t dt. But then of course we have the same base here, so I can combine those two, multiply them, multiplying those together. And so I can write this as e to the I can write this as e to the a minus s t f of t dt. But one subtle change I wanna make, instead of writing this as a minus s, what we can do is we can rewrite again, but factor a minus sign out of this. So what I'll do is I'll write it as e, and if I factor a minus out, we just need to kind of reverse it and write it as e to the minus s minus a t f of t. But then at this point, just notice that this is really set up like a Laplace transform. This value here is just a constant. Maybe what I could do to make this clear is to do a little substitution, not a substitution on the integral, but just for these constant values, s minus a, like let's say I call s minus a equal to n. So then doing it this way, if you just picture plugging it in here, this is actually just the Laplace transform of this function, but instead of getting a function in terms of s, now we have a function in terms of n. But again, n is just s minus a, so really what we have here is we're just saying that we're taking the Laplace transform, but our input now is this s minus a, and so all that happens when you have e to the at in front of some function is we need to know the Laplace transform of f of t because for this f of s notation, just notice that f of s is the same thing as the Laplace transform of f of t. So when we put e to the at in front of it, like we have here, all we've done is shifted it. So we just have to know, if you know this value of the Laplace transform of f of t from your table, or if you can calculate it, then all you need to do is shift it with this different input, s minus a. So if this is a little bit unfamiliar though, let's just take this formula and we can do a couple examples with it. Okay, so now we'll just go ahead and we'll look at the Laplace transform of e to the 2t times cosine of 6t. So we have, here's our eat, and then this cosine of 6t, this is gonna be our f of t that we have right here. So the first thing we really wanna do with this in order to find our like big f function is we want to find just the Laplace of ft. So what we want to look at is what is the Laplace of cosine of 6t. Well, we found a formula for this in a previous video, and what this is going to be is s over s squared times this a squared, 6 squared, and that's just going to give me 36. So this is going to be our f of s value. But what we want for this thing is we want f of s minus a, where our a value, our a is going to be just 2. So what we want to look at is we just want to find what is f of s minus 2. And we already have our function. We just need to change the input. So plugging s minus 2 in here, this is going to give me s minus 2. Then we're going to have in the denominator, well, this plugging in s minus 2 here gives me s minus 2 squared plus 36. And I'll just multiply this out. So we have same numerator. This is going to become s squared minus 4s plus 4 plus 36. And so for a solution to this thing, we're gonna have s minus two, s squared minus four s plus 40. And that's really all there is to it. So let's try another one of these. Okay, for this one, we've got the Laplace transform of e to the minus three t times t. And in this case, we're gonna just call our, this t is just gonna be our whole f of t, our a value, and this is gonna be minus three. So again, we'll start with our f of t. So we wanna find Laplace of f of t, and this is gonna be, just the Laplace of t. This is gonna be our big F of s function. But we did this one in a previous video. This is actually just one over s squared. Come back to our problem, we know what our F of s is. We just need to calculate our F of s minus a. So this thing is gonna be F of s minus minus three it gives me plus three. So we just need to plug s plus three in here. So this is gonna give me one over s plus three squared. I'll just multiply this out. We're gonna end up with one. This will give me s squared plus 6x, 6s plus nine, and that's that one. Okay, one last quick example. So again, here's gonna be, we'll call this our f of t, because this is our eat, and a is gonna be minus four. 
doing the same steps, we're gonna to wanna to find our f of s or the Laplace transform of our f of t. So that's gonna be just, I know my brackets are terrible, but that's all right. So we wanna find the Laplace of cinch of three t. And again, we have a formula for this. This is actually, this is our a value in this, different than this a value, but this is gonna be, in this formula, it's gonna be three over s squared minus the regular the regular trig functions are a plus the hyperbolic ones are minus this value squared gives me nine and so for what we want to do here we want to find f of s minus minus four or f of s plus four so we just need to input s plus four into our variable here so this is going to give me three over s plus four squared minus nine and we'll just multiply this out so we have three there this is going to become s squared plus 8s plus 16 minus 9. And so for our solution for this one, we have 3s squared plus 8s plus 7. So that's it. I find this one really interesting and useful. Laplace transform of EAT f of t. Thanks everyone for watching. Have a good day.